Hi, my name is Elise Reyes and this is Christopher Robinson. We are representatives from the GO team here at Charmin headquarters. Our job is to handle any crisis that comes up in our company. Recently, the past week, a fraternity had contacted us from Tucson, Arizona stating when using our product that they had irritation in places it should not be. Chris, you want to debrief a little bit on that? Sure. Enjoying the GO is always the dream here at Charmin and the GO team, we're the press um, or public relations side of our company and we want to relay to our customers that we're doing everything we can in our power to make sure that you're safe, comfortable, and enjoying the go. With that, we're going to open it up to any questions. Yes. How many people were affected? We got count about 20 people were infected. So like I said, it was a fraternity, so around 20 people. How serious is this irritation? How long is it going to last? From reports from five of the individuals at the University of Arizona campus, part of that fraternity, they experienced minor irritation that should last at the maximum two days. Washing the area of, of irritation should remedy the situation. I'm sorry. That, it is a very serious problem, and we experience that you know, using the restroom all the time, so we're trying to fix that. Can we take the next question, please? Why should we care since they attend U of A? Even though some of us might say that the University of Arizona is not the top school, uh, we do care about our customers no matter what university they go to, how old they are, whatever the range is. We just care about the satisfaction and we want everyone to be safe. So now that you're aware of the problem, what's your next step going to be? How are you going to deal with this? We have the answer here, Charmin, that we're going to strive to make considerable efforts as far as safety is concerned. Uh, we are working with the laboratories and chemists and taking random samples from our production line to ensure the safety of our customers and to ensure that the go is as comfortable as can be. Will there be any compensation for the fraternity at the University of Arizona? Yes, we plan to, as soon as we fix this problem, do the recall, we plan to either do some refunds on the money or hand out coupons that could make it up to them. Like I said, this is a very interesting problem that we've had. I can say working for our company, we haven't had this problem in ever. So So we, we, will, we will reach out yeah. to the campus and actually give things away and ensure that we have our brand in mind with them and hopefully they will consider us in the future. Yeah. So we can take the last question. In terms of financially, what negative conf uh, consequences do you foresee happening in the future? As Charmin, we understand that business and commerce takes its toll with events such as these, and we hope that our customer base really is as loyal as we think they are. And we, in the future, will consider that, and hopefully there are too many bumps in the road for our investors or our customers as far as price, or as far as our stocks are concerned. Being representatives from the GO team, we do represent Charmin. We are very into our team being a family. We do not want to have any mishaps anymore. We want to strive for success. So we hope that with this problem that it not only gets fixed, but it strengthens our company as well. So thank you so much for your questions, and we hope that everyone is satisfied. If you guys have any more questions or you can email us or you can give us a call at our headquarters. Thank or you very much. Or even tweet us. Even Thank tweet you. us. <laughs>